Hi everyone, welcome to another Weight Watchers Clinic dumbbell-based training routine. I am Justin, the fitness lead at Weight Watchers Clinic, and I'm gonna walk you through today's routine. So today's routine is going to have six exercises. The first time around that we go through these six exercises, I'll explain everything, where you should be feeling it, and it's gonna be optional if you wanna join me for a second or a third round. This is gonna take about 20-ish, a little bit more minutes all together to complete. Now the first exercise that we are going to do, if you have a little bit of wall space for some support, that's great. It's going to work our legs, specifically our glute meat or the side of our butt. You can put your hand on a wall right here for a little support. And we're just going out just like this. So from this side, it's gonna look just like that. And you should feel that right here. So we're gonna do 10 of those on each side. Again, you can hold on for a little bit of support, everything within your comfort and control. All right, so here we go. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and heading over to the other side. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, trying to keep your toe pointed forward, and 10, great job. Our next exercise is going to be the dumbbell deadlift. So we will use one dumbbell for this. Our toes are going to be pointing forward, our feet are shoulder width apart. Hold the weight right here. Let's push our hips back, keep our back straight, and bend our legs just slightly. Try not to let the weight get out in front of you, and make sure you're keeping your back as straight as you can. Here we go, doing 10 of these together. One, and if you feel comfortable with the range of motion maybe right here, that's what we'll use. Go within your comfort and control. Three, four, five, six, seven, Eight, nine, and 10. All right, so that was the deadlift. Again, working our hamstrings, glutes, some of our quads as well. The next one that we are going to do is called a cross body chop. We're gonna go in this position and we're going to go up, okay? And we're going to go five on each side. That's gonna work our shoulders, but also some of our core. All right, here we go, ready? One, two, three, four, and five. Let's do that other side. Here we go. One, two, three, four, and five. Great. We're gonna pick up our other weight. And this next one is called the dumbbell push press. So that's gonna work our shoulders. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna be in this position. We're going to bend our legs slightly, use that leg drive to push the weight up. If you have any shoulder issues, you can still do that leg bend and then push out instead. So if it's hard to go all the way over your head, go for that option. We're gonna do 10 of these together. Here we go. One, two, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Well done. So that was our push press. We have two exercises left. We're gonna put one weight down and we're going to do a single arm row. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna hinge back, put one arm here for support, and we're going to row up just like this, driving up with our elbow, not going up too high or not going out. There should only be a little space between your elbow right here and your body. So it's gonna work our biceps and our back. So here we go, we're gonna do 10. Keep your back nice and straight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 
seven, eight, nine, 10, great, let's switch sides. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. We have one exercise left. It's when you work our biceps, it's going to be the hammer curl. So we're just going right here. 10 curls, just like that, okay? So just bending at your elbow. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Well done. We are going to move on to our second round. That's gonna be your choice with those standing lateral leg raises. And as a reminder, if you're a clinic member, please consider reaching out if you have any questions. And if you're looking at this on the Weight Watchers app, remember you can join our Connect group. It's a strength training support group for any questions that you might have. Let's get our hand on the rail for support if we're using that. And we're gonna go 10 on each leg. Here we go. One, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Other side, here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10, well done. You're gonna get a 30 second break now and we'll be back for the dumbbell deadlift. Welcome back. Let's get into our dumbbell deadlift. Here we go. One, keep your back nice and straight. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine and 10, well done. I will see you back here in 30 seconds for the cross body chops. Here we go. One, two, nice little short one for this before one more break. Four, and five, other side. One, two, three, four, and five and we will be back here for the push press soon. Let's grab our other weight for the push press. 
Uh, one thing here, if you ever feel like you're extending at your low back like that, you can try staggering your stance, and I'll do that for this example here. Stagger your stance, use that leg drive, and then we're going right up, okay? Let's do 10 of these together, here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10, great job. We have two exercises left, so we'll be back here soon for that row. Let's get into our single arm row. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and other side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10, awesome. 30 second break and we're gonna wrap up second round with hammer curls. Here we go, final set of curls. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10, great job. If you are sticking with me, we will go into that third round. And so what we're gonna do is get our hand back on that rail if we are using the rail. And we're going 10 on each side. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. And then other side. One, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, in 30 seconds, we'll be back here for our last deadlift. Here we go, let's get into our last deadlift. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. And I will see you back here in 30 seconds for the cross body chop.
here we go. One, two, three, four, five, and other side. One, two, three, four, and five, awesome. Take a 30 second break, we'll be back here for our last push press. Here we go, remember use that staggered stance position if you feel like you need a little bit more support on your back, so here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10, awesome job. I'll see you back here in 30 seconds for your row. Let's get into our last row. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and other side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine and ten. Great job. One more exercise left the hammer curl. See you back here soon. Here we go, let's get into our last hammer curl. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Really great work today. Way to prioritize your health. And I will go ahead and see you back here for your next strength training routine.